hello um now it's been long that i said it would since i made a video and that's mainly due to procrastination um because i'm lazy um i said this video would be on the hawking penrose theorem and what that is it it's a co-work between Roger Penrose and Stephen Hawking and it was Stephen Hawking's first big work um, mostly recognised um, what it's to do with is light is a strong enough force to outrun um, the gravitational pull of most planets and stars um, now what would happen if this planet or star was broken down and heavier and more concentrated then the gravitational pull gets stronger and stronger. So the heavier and denser, the stronger the gravitational pull on the planet or star. So what happens, what happens when the, the gravitational pull gets to a certain point of strength, um, it starts to pull everything into it um, and nothing is able to outrun it. This is when a singularity forms. Now a singularity is when time, space, light and matter all fold in on themselves and creates a black hole, essentially. There's nothing left inside that. Um, now, people thought to first that singularities were at the start of the universe because as um, our universe gets to a certain point, it will start to fold in on itself and it will create its own singularity. Now, people thought that time and space were left in singularity and that um, was reversed into the Big Bang and made our universe. However, this has been disproven um, by other theories as time and space, when it goes into singularity, it disappears. A black hole um, disintegrates everything, so that is unable to happen. Um, now, there are a lot of other theories on the start of the universe um, and how our universe connects together. And one of the most known ones is the string theory. So, in my next video, I will be talking about the string theory and how it connects everything up to modern day. So I will have that video up next week. Um, I will have a video up once a week. I will promise you that unless there's something very important happening. So okay, um, you may have noticed my eyes look different as well. I got these contacts in London. Um, they're yellow but they're atoms so you should be able to see the red in them. Yeah. So for a day and yeah okay bye